What's going on? What's popping, you guys? You know who it is. It's your boy, Keith Fit. All right, and I'm just here with another brief message for you guys. I'm not going to make this video too long. But uh, the message is eliminate vices, right? So what is vices? Vices are things that uh, we tend to spend money on uh, for enjoyment, for our pleasure, and things of that nature. But as we begin to eliminate the ones that are not necessary, the ones that are not needed, um, such as such as alcohol, such as weed, such as cigarettes, such as black and miles and things like that, things that we're spending our money on constantly every day. If we eliminate those things, we'll be able to save money. Just think about it. If you're spending twenty dollars a day on two on on a twenty bag or if you're spending twenty dollars a day on a bottle, uh, or if you're spending five dollars a day on black and miles, or spending what is it, nine dollars, eight, nine dollars a day on a pack of cigarettes, how much money are you losing out on? Calculate that. Like twenty dollars times five, that's a hundred dollars a week. A hundred dollars that you could that you that you're blowing. That you could be putting up in a savings account, stacking your bread, getting your money together. So that way, one day, of course, it takes time to build. But one day in the future, you're going to have a couple bands stacked up. You know what I mean? Make, and that's a boss move right there. Make an investment somewhere. But down payment on a house. Down payment on a new car. As long as you keep it up. For as long as you want to just keep it up. Just stash that money. And let's eliminate the things that's breaking us down and slowing us down. Let's keep pushing. Let's keep moving to success. Moving to a better version of ourselves. You know what I mean? Let's create that. The only one that can create that is you. Don't slow yourself down. Don't derail yourself by... And I get it. They say you are who you hang around. Right? The world will view you as... Who you hang around. If I'm hanging around a bunch of drug dealers. Uh, then I'm going to be viewed as a drug dealer. It's impossible to be in a car. With three drug dealers. And you're the fourth one. And y'all all get pulled over. And something not happen to you. You know what I'm saying. Like It's the same with everything else in life. If I'm hanging around a bunch of people. Who smoke weed all the time. Then it's only natural. For my uh, interest to be triggered. And. Once it's triggered, and once it's triggered, and once it's going, guess what? It's going. You're trapped. You're now spending excess money that you shouldn't be spending, um, that you could be investing, you could be saving. You're spending it on stuff for what? Just for the moment? Let's not live for the moment. That's no, but yeah, let me, let me re reword that for y'all. Let's live for the moment, but plan on the future. Um, you only get one life to live, right? And all we can, can control, all we have to control is our right now. You can't go back to tomorrow, but you can prepare for the future. So that way, if you're blessed enough to wake up tomorrow, you're in a better position tomorrow than you was today. All right. So let's do me a favor. Do yourself a favor. Let's start eliminating these vices. Let's start de let's start getting off of that. Off of that, start doing what you see other people do. Be a leader. Create your own your own path. Create a better path for yourself. And I'm just giving you some help to guide you. Some words of, enc of encouragement to help guide you in the right direction. A better direction for yourself. For your children. For your family. For your cousin. For your brother. For your uncle. For your sister. For your mom. For your dad. For your grandparents. For all of them. You know what I'm saying? So, again, let's eliminate those vices, all right? Let's keep pushing for success. Keep pushing to be a better version of ourselves, all right? I love those who love me. And if you don't love me, guess what? I still love you. And because I love you, I'm sharing this content to you. I hope something within it resonates um, within you and allows you and opens your eyes to give you the opportunity 
to create a better tomorrow for yourselves. All right. Wishing y'all nothing but the best. All right. Till next time. I'm out of here. Peace.